It would be hard to say if Cole Palin actually had a favorite airplane. He loved them all. But he had a special affection for his 1931 Great Lakes trainer. Why the Great Lakes and why do pilots love them so much? This is a 1931 version. It's powered by the 125 horsepower Manasco Super Pirate engine, which was the best of the several engines that was in it. But it's a perfectly balanced airplane. It flies so nicely. It's extremely aerobatic. It's just as happy upside down as it is right side up. And with an inverted engine, it will fly upside down all day. But it's just a delight to fly. Tex Rankin was a famous Great Lakes dealer. And he flew more than 200 outside loops in a Great Lakes trainer. They were used in aerobatic competition around the world as late as into the late 1960s and 1970s. They were competing against airplanes that far outclassed them, yet they had the ability to perform the maneuvers. This airplane, NC-304Y, was used by Great Lakes for much of their print advertising when it was built. The airplane came to the Northeast. It was flown in Connecticut for a long time. It is restored at the old Rhinebeck Aerodrome, late of a junkyard outside of Bridgeport, Connecticut. Right now it's in the Aerodrome Museum, awaiting another refurbishing. We hope to see it back in the sky soon. <laughs>